Welcome to Smart Conserver. The solar water heater was the first instance I ever go solar. Can I tell you? Sometimes what you think will be a bit different from what the supplier will show you as a reality. I think sometimes suppliers think you know what you really want before you decide to buy. Oftentimes, you do know what we want the thing to do, but you don't know the small but important aspect about the item. Well, it was that way with, the, with me and the solar water heater. I know what I wanted it to do, which was to heat the water so that I can get hot water in the shower and the kitchen. I was also intrigued with the word solar. So to me, it meant no light bill for the hot water. I already had a supplier in mind who I wanted to purchase this from. So I set out to get a coat. What I liked about my chosen supplier were the questioning. I especially like to be questioned by them as they will get an idea as to what I'm thinking and that I need and to determine if they can supply what I had in mind. I was asked, how many persons are you thinking of that will use this hot water? Luckily, I doubled the amount of persons living in my household and asked him to, to add two more in case I have guests. Looking back, no, I know my response helped me greatly. And I will soon tell you about that. Hold on. I was also asked if I wanted it to be connected to electricity as well. <laughs> Just imagine my surprise at that question. As in my head, if it's solar, then there's no need for the light people. I inquired about what the benefits with or without the light people were and the reason I was given was this. If the time was cloudy, then I would not get the hot water I need as there was no sun. So now you see the issue? Well, I decided to take my chances. No light people to this, fully sun. Did it work without the light people? Oh yes, if I get up any time during the night, even if the time was cloudy for a few days, I can be guaranteed to get hot water from my kitchen and the bathroom faucets. What I think helped me was the fact that I got a size water heater that was bigger than my actual current household. You see how the bigger size helped me? What happened is when the water is heated by the panels, the heated water is stored in a well-insulated tank, preventing the water from cooling down too much before it's used. So my well-insulated tank can store enough water for me to use until the sun eventually decides to shine. And also, I will show you evidence another time that these panels they are now making are so sensitive that even a glare can get them working. Another thing too, my hot water is not attached to the washing machine. You know, as a child growing up, my mother never used hot water to wash, so I can't say I'm used to it. And can I tell you, my clothes always came out smelling clean and fresh. So using this hot water was never my thing. Yeah. You have to be smart people, please. You can gain the benefit of the sun with the right thinking. Just consider your options when, when you're questioned by the supplier. It may work for you, just as it did for me. You have come to the end of another series. Join us next time for more ways to conserve.